everybody so today I am here to talk to you guys all about my jewelry staples I have gotten so many questions about my jewelry you guys want to know where do I get it from how do I find pieces that are high quality and last and um, so I'm gonna give you all the details today I've been kind of avoiding this question because I get jewelry questions on pretty much every video that I do and I've been avoiding answering the question of where I get my jewelry from because I have a little secret guys um y'all know how I do I'm sorry <laughs> for holding back but I actually have my own jewelry and accessory line it's brand new it just came out as of me making this video and it is called second and C, and that is where my jewelry is from and I'm really excited about this because I have realized over the years of me trying to curate a staple jewelry collection that it is really really hard to find good quality pieces pieces that you can wear for every day but also pieces that can be worn for nighttime if you want to dress up a little bit more and that don't cost an arm and a leg and I was just like I'm tired of this I'm tired of trying to find stuff I'm tired of ordering things getting things and then once I receive it it just doesn't match up to what I expected I know exactly what I want I need to just create it and that's exactly what I did secondandc.com you guys can check it out peruse and see everything that I have available but just to give you an overview of my jewelry line in particular because I do have um, hair goods accessories and stuff like that my pieces are everyday glam like you put these on and they bring just a nice pop to your outfit a very nice accent and I wanted to create a collection that was cohesive so my pieces they're really easy to mix and match with each other and get different looks which I really really love so if y'all go through my videos or even my Instagram y'all can see that I like to wear the same things I might switch them up I might pair them differently but my core pieces I keep them in rotation and my second and C pieces they just elevate any outfit any look without being too much and all of my jewelry pieces they are nickel free they are plated with real gold so they are very tarnish resistant and I literally do everything in my jewelry like I shower with it on I swim with it on I do all types of stuff I do the dishes with my jewelry on I'm not the type of person that takes my jewelry off at night um, some people are like that I'm just not I'm kind of lazy in that way I just keep it on until I need to change up my vibe so I keep my pieces on through whatever like when I'm washing my body my jewelry gets washed too and my jewelry looks like the day I put it on so this is a collection of things that I am truly proud of that I think you guys will love and the finishes on all my jewelry is just so nice it looks so chic you can definitely tell it's not like your run-of-the-mill costume jewelry stuff that you put on and then you wear it a couple times and it starts turning colors no 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 not with second and C. So I'm gonna just go ahead really quickly and walk you through each of my staple pieces. I will begin with what I have on right now. So one of the things I get the most questions about lately are these earrings here, these key hoop earrings. I love hoop earrings and um, these, the key is detachable so if you just want to wear them as hoops you can but I think the key just adds that little extra something it makes them look so much more interesting I mean I always get questions on these earrings guys they just look super super cool but again understated it's not too much and I just love the detailing on the key I love how it hangs on these earrings and I especially love rocking these hoops when I'm wearing some type of updo because it really shows the earrings off I also have these key hoops available in these super small hoops so if you're a person that really doesn't like big earrings you really don't like big hoops these small ones are really great they're very dainty and they just add that unexpected element to just a basic pair of hoops so these hoops they have just been in rotation so so heavy and then on a day-to-day -day, even if I'm not wearing much jewelry even if I'm not overly accessorizing my go-to earrings the ones that I always have in are just these studs I kind of like them in a bigger size just to stand out more but yeah nice go-to stud I feel is a necessity next up I have my snake herringbone choker now this comes with an extender so you can wear it super tight as like a choker like I'm wearing today or you can loosen it up just a little bit and let it hang down and I like it because it's just so sleek and clean and I feel like everyone should have a herringbone necklace they are great for just adding that nice pop of gold and these are also great for layering they're so so good in layering so right now with it I'm wearing my saint pendant necklace I really love wearing this 
um, especially when I'm wearing tops that kind of have like a V cut in the front and um, I just think it lays so nice just accentuates the cut and the shape and I just think it looks great so I got that on and then I mean these two pieces they just mesh so well together now speaking of my snake herringbone necklace I also have a bracelet in the same size it's very understated like if you're a person that you don't want to do too much on your wrist or you're not used to wearing a lot of jewelry just having a simple clean herringbone bracelet will set you off so nicely. Now I personally like to stack my bracelets and I have different stacks on each arm so I'll show you guys what I'm doing for each side. So I have my snake herringbone bracelet here, I have this thin tube bracelet and then I have this cuff bangle. It plays with the widths of the three pieces that I have. I usually like to stack in three because I just think it looks nice. I think it's a science to that as well. And this solid bar bangle, this is my absolute favorite piece of arm candy. I love just, I can stack these, I can just wear a arm full of these bangles. I can pair them with different bracelets. So simple, but they give your outfit so much and you guys will notice in my videos, in my pictures, I'm always wearing these things. So this is a piece that I'm always rocking and if you are in the process of building a staple jewelry collection this is something I would definitely recommend you guys getting now on this arm let me pull my sleeve up I have this stack here I have two of my solid bangles and then this Cuban link chain bracelet so this is one of my go-to arm stacks because I love again grouping my bracelets in three but also I love that it plays with the different texture just mixing and matching like this stack is so stylish to me I love it love it love it and it just really makes your outfit pop and the Cuban link I don't know if it's just me but Cuban links it just makes you feel like <laughs> you're affluent like it gives you that rich feeling and just the shine on this the color the way that it catches the light it is amazing and then in addition to my slim Cuban link bracelet I have the matching necklace and I wear this a ton 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 too and again just like pretty much all my other pieces this is great for stacking so I love just playing around mixing and matching and layering it, it highlights your neck it brings that shine and brilliance to your look and if you want that understated like air of elegance and richness then this is perfect but if you want to do just a little bit more you want to be a little more blinky um i also have the cuban link necklace in a larger size i really love just rocking this by itself with um, a plain t-shirt because it really does dress it up so much it makes you look ultra put together it makes you look ultra stylish it makes you look ultra it and then another piece that i practically live in I'm surprised that I don't have it on today <laughs> um, but it is my bar necklace when I say this is the perfect everyday piece it goes with almost anything and it's great to just keep on from day to day because it just works it's a nice accent it's very simple but it still does give you that golden touch it gives you that extra touch so this one has the word love engraved on the front I just wanted to put like a positive word a positive affirmation on my necklace and then on the back if you don't want to um, show the love you can turn it over and wear it as a simple clean bar whenever I am going to put some clothes on and I don't feel like thinking too much I know I will be good with my bar necklace another bracelet I have on rotation heavy is this one right here this link bracelet this one though I don't usually wear it on my wrist because I like the the Cuban link on my wrist I do wear this on my wrist sometimes but mostly I wear it as an anklet actually and I have had this on my ankle for the longest time for months now and I've literally only taken it off to show it to you guys in this video and it just sets off any type of shoes I'm wearing it really looks nice having an anklet on and then another piece I also like to layer with is this paper clip necklace I really like wearing this with my herringbone necklace because it just gives you that contrast between the solid piece and this link piece so this is great for layering or also just wearing it by itself as a choker and then finally of course we can't forget about the rings the finger 
accessories. Now I don't usually wear finger rings every day. It's only when I want to be a little bit extra, you know. But when I do, I'm usually reaching for these three rings. These are also available on Second and C. And the good thing about these is that they are adjustable because we all know how sometimes it's a little difficult to get rings on and off because, you know, we get water weight, we get bloating, we get all that, and our fingers kind of puff up sometimes. Maybe we eat too much salty foods. You won't have any problems with these because they can be adjustable you can open them close them to fit your finger so these I just love how they accent especially when you get your nails done having some rings on it really just shows them off uh, uh, uh. I just really like mixing and matching because it just makes you look more interesting it makes you look like you're creative you put some thought into what you're wearing speaking of accenting your nails this is unrelated to jewelry but you guys have been asking me about these nails as well because I've been wearing them a ton and I've just been lately obsessed with this style of nail with the green accents on the tips and you guys were asking me did I do my own nails are they press-ons like I usually wear and they are guys they are press-ons and for those of you interested and you want to get your nails super fly like this these are also on secondandc.com I will put the direct link right below in the description box so in case you're wondering about these nails you can get them yourself and get a five minute salon looking set right at home so yeah guys that is the rundown on my staple jewelry I am just so excited for you guys to have this for you guys to wear my pieces and let me know what you think about them and I hope you love the pieces just as much as I do because they've really been working for me in my everyday life they've really been working to elevate my outfits elevate my look again the site is secondnc.com I will have the links and all information you need right down in the description box thanks so much guys for watching and I'll catch up with you soon on my next video peace